we want to know what's the formation of Zilon in the deep earth. That's basically what we are interested in and many people are also interested in. Uh, xenon is one of the noble gases. It's the heaviest of non-radioactive noble gases, um, the chemistry of which uh, attracts a lot of attention uh, for the last 80 years. In fact, it's 80 years since the famous prediction of great chemist Linus Pauling that xenon should form stable compounds with fluorine and oxygen. And the prediction uh, for stable compounds with fluorine took about 30 years to verify experimentally. First attempts to verify this prediction were unsuccessful. And then finally in six, 1962, uh, for stable xenon fluorides were found. Stable xenon oxides are not known up to now. And we have made a detailed prediction um, uh, which says at which conditions of pressure and temperature they can be found. Evolutionary algorithm, we success successfully predict that xenon can become active under high pressure and thus they can form step, uh, thermodynamically stable xenon oxygen compounds. And the, our discovery shed a light on the mis geologically interesting missing xenon paradox. The important geological puzzle uh, that our work d deals with is the missing xenon paradox. Uh, our results shed light onto the possible causes of this missing xenon paradox. Uh, one of the prominent hypotheses before our work was that xenon and oxygen form stable compounds already at conditions of the Earth's mantle. Um, we find that xenon and oxygen indeed form very stable compounds. But these compounds nevertheless cannot exist in the Earth's mantle because there they will participate in chemical reactions, oxidation reac reduction reactions, and uh, they will not stay. So this explanation has to be abandoned. Nevertheless, we still think that xenon can be retained at grain boundaries and defects in mantle minerals. So we have made significant corrections to the previous, uh, previously proposed mechanism.